planting one of the finds in at the house. This is a Rose of Sharon, also known as, I forget what kind of hibiscus. She's a light pink, real pretty. She was found, uh, thrown away in a, in a compost pile at, uh, you know, just to left to die when she was real small. So she's going to look real good here on the side of the house and kind of block some of the view into the backyard. I thought I'd show y'all some of our East Texas wildlife without me getting too close to them. Got a pretty black widow in there. You can kind of see her in the red. I'm not going to kill her or anything. I am going to get rid of this um, stump, so I don't know. Kind of hiding the red here. Another angle would be this way, I think. Yeah, you can see. Doing a little videoing. Uh, first thing I saw looking in here. Might be something back over there. That looks kind of broken. That's what that is. I'm gonna get it. Let's see if there's any keepers in here. That's real cute. Oh, this is sad. This is cute. Look at the Christmas things. Let's put these Christmas things together. I like Christmas things. Save them from the duck. Snowman frame. Not broken. Oh, that's a cute hand painted tulip vase. I like that.
cute. It's pretty. Oh, it's a church with snow on top. It's in the steeple thing, I guess. What's this? 1981. That's the first Christmas. has a kid's name on it, so it's kind of sad. Bottle opener. Come down to the south end of it here. Oh, oh, oh. Dumpster magic. This is dumpster magic. Look how cute. And all this is going, 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 going for the trash. I'll get, you know, I might do a little video just on this bag in a little while. Oh, that is awesome. Very happy with that. Here's some more Christmas. And more Christmas. I'll get back to y'all later on this other bag. Thanks for watching. As promised, here's the the other little bag of things. First there was a few other things that were just kind of smashed down, but there's a I believe a Native American ornament. Super nice. Very nice. She's got something to hang her. Funny looking little <laughs> little guy. We're making some shrimp cocktail over here, so that's what's going on. Mixing up that shrimp cocktail. going to be good. Little mouse like him. Oh, is that? I don't know if that's a bluebird or not. But that's cute. Tangled up with. Oh, these are all tangled. Sorry. Uh, Angel, her hair got everything tangled in it. That's hilarious. This was the dumb part of the dumpster magic I was going to talk about. This one little bag. Oh, I've already kind of unrolled that and saw. Christmas 1988, the Polar Express, and it is a little boy's Christmas ornaments that somebody painstakingly wrote every year, and um, then somebody got rid of them in the dumpster, and not not anymore. They're out. These are so cute. Lots of random little things in there. Look at the tiny little sliced up watermelons in a basket. And the basket. I can't tell if it's, it's just the same kind of material. There you go. Have some watermelon. Wooden teddy bear pen. Needs to be clean. It says one teaspoon. Very cute. Cute. A, a half a teaspoon. Probably an eighth of a teaspoon. A fourth of a teaspoon. Those are so cute. I will clean those up and they will be in my kitchen. As you can see, they go with the yellow countertop that's been here, original 1975. Little sled. This might be the Santa that goes in it. It looks like it is. Or something like that. And these are dusty, and they're missing some little parts, but there you go. I mean, they're just so cute. Dumpster magic, folks. Look at this. There's the little guy on the sled again. Here's something for July the 4th. Grab it. And let's see how. Look at this. Got a little, little train in it. Just little wooden things. Another watermelon. Little house. It might go with these little villagers. And the rest are just these little wooden blocks, I believe. I don't know what kind of die that is and what kind of game. Anyway. Uh, that's it. Just lots of, lots of, lots of awesome things. Thanks for watching. Good luck to everybody.